Hi everybody! Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be so different than what I have ever done here on my channel. But I have had requests for this video and y'all, it's time to change this beauty out. I'm going to be getting rid of all of the beautiful princesses for the season. Um, it'll probably, they'll be gone through Halloween and Christmas. They'll be back though. And y'all, it's time to decorate for the holiday. I've started out with my t-shirt of uh, <laughs> Jack Skeleton and Halloween. And I even have my, let me show you, Mitzi would be so proud. I have my Halloween Crocs on. <laughs> so y'all, I'm going to try to film me changing this background out. I'm kind of scrunching down so you can see me, but uh, I'm going to try to change out my whole background and let you watch the whole thing, okay? See how I do it. See what I put up. So if y'all ready, let's go. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do before I even take stuff off the shelf is get out my Halloween stuff. So, y'all, you've never seen behind these doors before. <laughs> Only one person has seen behind these doors. This is where I store everything that's not on my shelf, somewhere on my wall. Um, up here, I've got all of my sequins bags. Um, they're too deep. You can see back there. There's another each one has two behind it or one behind it So it's two total, but yeah, so that's sitting up on the shelf down here. I have uh, Bags hanging on boot clips. Um, I don't use this. I did at one time uh, Use this to hold them, but I felt like it was leaving a mark on my bag so I just lay it behind the clip on the hook and it seems to work fine you can see this better without the um, thing but I don't use this anymore I saw it was leaving marks on my bag so yeah oh my gosh so I have all of these hanging they're too deep back there as you can see and if you have a closet that's deeper you could even hang more but love that and then I have some sitting on top of the bins so um yeah i'm just struggling for space but um in the bins are all of my holiday stuff so i'm gonna pull out my halloween stuff and let's get started so we gotta get rid of all these goodies on top of the bins I got the bins empty and these are all of my Halloween and villains bags that need to go up on the shelf so we got that step done okay we're gonna start at the top and take our goodies down okay that's clear. Let's start the rest.
Okay, <laughs> it's cleaned out. Now, I gotta put new stuff in there. So, yeah. Um, I will tell you, because I may get questions, I will put the info for these lights um, in the description down below. So, they're from Amazon. Um, and you might always wonder why my two shelves don't meet together flush. And I gotta straighten this one up. It's because the light sensor, to cut them on and off, lays in between these shelves. So they won't go all the way flush together because of that sensor that sits in between them so that I can turn them on and off. So yeah, let's get started. So here's all the beautiful bags that I just took off my shelf. And of course, I have some over here as well. All of my gym shores and Couture de Force, they're over here. So, yeah. I'm gonna, the first thing I'm gonna do is have my husband hang this gorgeous wreath that Meetsy made me. And it's gonna go, I want it to go right in the middle above my display. So let me see if I can find him. <laughs> okay, he's hanging the wreath now. Can't wait to see it up. Okay, so the Hocus Pocus goes straight up and down. So I asked him to hang it a little bit higher because I'm gonna have villains um, backpacks lined across the top of the shelves. Oh, it looks good, babe! Look at there, it's beautiful. Mitzi did such a great job on that thing. So beautiful, thank you, babe. Okay, so now that we have our wreath up and I have everything cleaned off here, now it's time to take um, our rag and clean our shelves because I always do that in between uh, switching up my background. And so, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so um, after cleaning, the next thing I like to do is I like to change the color of my lights. And it kind of encourages me for the season. And so a lot of times I like to make it orange for Halloween. So let me just play around with it. Um, this is a universal remote. Well, I won't say universal. It is a remote that comes with it, but I have multiple lights on this shelving unit, and so it'll control all the different sets. So that's the better way to say it. So let me just try some things and start out and see where it goes. So that looks kind of yellow. That's not what I want. That's a little bit more orange. Um... That's actually red. I don't want red. So let's go with the orange. Let's just start with that. Change that one and change that one. Okay, y'all, I'm ready to start putting some goodies up.
Okay guys, <laughs> I'm finished. I think for the most part I'm finished. I'm a hot mess. Um, I'm sweating, I'm tired. Um, you guys have seen just a small portion of what I've done, but it's taken me all day to do this. <laughs> so um, it's dinner time already. But yeah, I just wanted to do this. We ha I had so many requests for this. I've never done anything like this before, so I hope that you will get a sense of, of what I do and how I do it. Um, I have put out every single bag that I started out with. Maybe one crossbody I didn't put out, but um, everything else is here, y'all, <laughs> from top to the bottom. I got my Couture de Force, I've got all my Jim Shores. Um, I had just one or two Jim Shores that I didn't put out, but um, yeah, I'm really excited about this one being here this year. It's new from uh, Enchanted Mystery, so I was so excited for that. I'm definitely gonna, I might fiddle with it just a few minutes more, but I'm going to turn the camera around and show you everything up close, and that'll be at the end. So, all right guys, thank you so much. So glad you were here. We'll see you the next time. Bye. So I'm starting up here with the wreath that Mitzi made for me a couple years ago. And it's my Hocus Pocus wreath. So I wanted it to be um, in the center of my background. And then I like to put my villain uh, cross, I mean my villain backpacks um, here on the top. So you can see all of the ones that I have. Love the Evil Queen, that's one of my favorites. So is this one. Love that one. There's my villain, Corella. There's Hades and Stitch Shop books. And then coming down, here is the beautiful sequins bag from this year. Just gorgeous. Uh, here's Jim Shore, Vampire Mickey, and uh, Minnie Mouse as a witch. This is from a couple of years ago. His little ear is wonky, I need to fix that. Here is a Haunted Mansion shelf that I am just so in love with. Here's my Dooney and Burke Haunted Mansion wallpaper bag. It's a tote. And then here is the gorgeous piece that I got in my Enchanted Mysteries box. Is that not stunning? Just absolutely gorgeous. I love it. And then um, here is another one that I love. I believe Mitzi gave me this for Christmas, Hitchhiking Ghost. And these are from last year. And uh, that one was from Loungefly. And this one was from a small shop. I forget which one. And then I've got some exclusives down here. Um, I think the mayor was from uh, Grotto's Treasure. And then this was an exclusive also. Love those. And then if I'm gonna come across here, I got the Stitch Shop Ghost. And then this is from LA Rush. And it's the bat, Mickey bat. And then here is Winifred. And here's another Hocus Pocus bag. And here we have got all of my Jack and Sally's. I love these. These are all Couture de Force. Um, I love this one. Mitzi's given me most of these and I've bought a couple. Love that of Jack and Sally, just stunning. And then this one I bought. And then Mitzi gave me these two. They're just so precious. Now this one I think might just be a regular Jim Shore back there. I don't think it's Couture first. It might be, I don't think so. But I love my Jack and Sally's. And then I just love this shelf. I love the Mickey and Minnie pumpkins. And then this is the bag from the parks a couple of years ago. And then the cutest dopey Halloween Jim Shore. So I love, love, love this shelf. And then up here, I love this. I think this is from Comic Spot. It's Jack and Sally together. 
in a cosplay bag. This one right here, um, oh my gosh, I forget her name, but it is another figurine. I just love it. It's of the kids from Nightmare Before Christmas. Uh, Miss Mindy, that's who that is. That is from Miss Mindy. And look at the bow. I love that bow on top of that hat. And then this was another bag from last year. It's Mickey Spider. Love this zipper pull. I just think it's beautiful. This stuff, uh, this definitely glows in the dark. And then another fun shelf is another Haunted Mansion shelf. Um, this is the Duty and Burke Haunted Mansion from a couple of years ago. This is the Haunted Mansion bag from the Disney Parks. And then this is a Jim Shore with the uh, hat box ghost. And uh, his face will come off and I can put it in that little jar. But I like his face on his head. <laughs> And then, this is a stunning shelf. I need to get a cute uh, figure to go here for Hocus Pocus, but this is the Dooney and Burke, never been carried. Mitzi gave me that for Christmas several years ago, and she also gave me this one. I about fell out when I got these pieces, I'm not gonna lie, just beautiful. And then two that I just love are Mickey and Minnie, Ghost Mickey and Minnie. And they really glow in the dark. And then here are vampire, or not vampire, but um, Frankenstein, Mickey and Minnie. And then down here, I've got Jack and I got Sally. And then down here, I've got Zero. This is the first original bag that was released of Zero. And then I got the um, Jim Shore of Boogie Boogie, and then that's the original bag that was released at the small shops. And then I put this out here just because I don't have anywhere to put it, y'all. I've run out of space. So, yeah, that's everything, guys. This is my entire Halloween display. Um, you know, you might see some other things added. You might meet, see me change some stuff out as the season goes. But y'all, I'm excited, it's finally done. All right, thank you guys for hanging out with me.